What should I offer you? My sister, I was going to the market and decided to say hello to you. Priska, share because then after today now you won't go market. When last you go market? Uh, I don't understand. Today, what's so special about today? We go market before now. Today is Valentine now. You don't say. Did you forget? So, today not Valentine. I don't know. I, I, I'm not aware. Hey. I would have thought that um, Paul would keep a surprise no, for I you. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. Don't mention that. You don't even mention such name to me. Paul. Is that one husband? Yeah, they call husband, they call Paul. I beg, I beg, I beg. Please, don't spoil my day today. I want to be a husband oh. now. Does he even know what is Valentine? Does he know what they call Valentine? I beg, I beg, don't even spoil my day. That man is just so, just so selfish. So selfish and so archaic. So unexposed. What kind of husband is that? He doesn't care about me. All he cares about is his kids, his children. My friend, see you now. Look at you. See your place. You know, you've been so lucky since our school days. Only rich men, you have rich men at your beck and call. See your husband and see Gabriel. See, see this place. Wait till I get. Every day, I will go market. Manage. Before they bring money, give me. Manage. We will fight every day. Ah, no, it's, it's, it's just be patient. <laughs> I'm even expecting something very special from you. <laughs> Gabriel. Okay. See you. See my friend now. Men, they buy their wife's gifts. Men, they remember their wife. Give them, spoil them with gifts. But look at you. Look at you now. Look at you. See, see, see how you shine. See me now. My husband, what do you care about? Just his children's education. He doesn't even know that he has a wife. Won't he take care of me as a wife? Please, car, calm down. That's understandable now. Eh? At least the man will finish school. So maybe uh -huh. he's just trying to make sure his kids go through school. No, 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 babe, no, 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 they talk like this. Now, you're not babe now. Why, why are you talking like this? So, because man not finish school, they dead and somebody not take care of him, wife? Babe, no talk, this guy, no support him, I beg, no support him. He no good. So, the school will not go affect him, brain, so he no go take care of him, wife? Not be so now. If I, if I wasn't taking care of will he see me to get married to me? I beg, I beg, I beg. In fact, I don't want to spoil my day. Anytime I hear this poor matter, I know they, 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 they scatter my head. If they spoil anything about poor, just they spoil my day. I don't want to hear about Please, that. Please, Change. Oh, change, oh. This it, market where they go, so if I say go use pepper, but they enter the market, make I give you small kai kai for me. I don't no want it. Oh. You just calm yourself down. Your blood is in the hot. Make I bring kai kai for me. I don't bring kai kai for you when you drink. I don't bring my drink. This man is not change. Me, I don't go change. <laughs> what kind of man? Best be so now. See my friend. Now. See, see, see. Just, 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 just see. See shop. Not be girl. Not be woman. She be like me. You. Don't you know how to drive? I'm sorry, I, I just got distracted. I'm so sorry. Distracted, my foot. Look, young man, better get grip of yourself and drive like a human being. What nonsense? Jesus, this man, do you want to kill me? If you can't drive this vehicle, just let me know. Let me get down this minute. I'm sorry, ma. Sorry for yourself. Listen, I got kids at home and I don't want to die. What kind of driving is this? What's all this? Ha! I'm sorry, ma. My love. My love! My love! Hey, 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 hey. Where is it? What is it? What is the problem? Why are you shouting? Please, help me get that envelope on the, on the drawer there, in the room, please. Eh? As what? As your maid or what? My friend, go and get the envelope yourself if you want envelope. Oh, 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 oh. So you were even preparing to go out without even letting me know? Oh. Eh? No, no, my, uh, my boss called me. So he said I should come and see him this morning. Hey! I have to leave. What kind of work is this? What kind of wala is this? You go out early morning, you come back late with nothing, nothing to show for it. You come back with peanuts, nothing to show for it. Peanuts I don't even see. Eh? 
What is it? I'm talking to you. Are you asking what is what is wrong with you? Why are you touching your eyes? Answer me now. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just uh, think something to my eye. Anyways, that's your problem. I need money. I need money to get some stuff in the house. Like how much? Twenty thousand naira. Twenty thousand. Twenty k. Where am I supposed to get that from? What is wrong with this? Twenty k. Twenty million. Twenty k. Twenty k. Come on, twenty k. Yeah, shut. Twenty k. Ah ah. Are you that poor? Are you not working? Are they not paying you? Or are you working for free? Are you, are you asking me where, you, where you, are, you, are, you are to get the money from? Eh? My friend, give me 20,000 and let me use to do things for you. And make sure when you want to give me the money, make sure you add something to it too because I need to buy things for the children. Babe, I don't have 20K. But I will send to your account what I have with me. Okay? Please, I have to leave now. Come, what do you even have? You don't have money. You don't have time. What am I doing with you? Give me time, Kwanu. You don't, you don't, you are not here for me. Give me money you don't have. What am I doing with you? Is it your face I will chop? Handsome, handsome. Hands, not some. There's nothing on your hand. Uh, uh, you. You're not helping me get the envelope. My friend, go and get it yourself as your maid or, or, or what? Come, make sure. See, if you want to send me something from your account, make sure you make it big go. Uh -uh, what am I? You better stay in the house now. Make I know Sinami, they do the work. Stay in the house. 62 million. Good morning, sir. You sent for me, sir. Good morning, Paul. Yes, I sent for you. What's all these complaints I'm hearing about you? I mean, I, oh, let me ask you. Are you okay? Yes, sir. I mean, are you physically fit? Yes, sir. Then why are the customers complaining about you? Okay? They're complaining about the fact that you, uh, they have issues with the way you drive. Are you drinking and driving? No, no, sir. I don't. No, I don't even drink, sir. Then how come all these complaints about you being on the steering, not realizing the fact that you are on the steering? I'm, I'm sorry, sir. It won't happen again, sir. Look, this is not a matter of it not happening again, Paul. Okay? If it's a family issue, I suggest that you deal with it. And if it's a health issue, go and see a doctor. Yes, sir. Look, Mr. Man, I will not tolerate this again. Okay? Yes. I tell you. Thank you, sir. Nonsense. Ah, take it after me. Who is this one? Why are you here? Ah. Auntie, why the patient now? Is it not my brother's house? Uh -huh. Your brother's house, is it your husband's house? So you think because it's your brother's house, you can just come into my house unannounced? Ah, uh, Auntie, why all these questions now? Eh? Do I need a new scars to go scars that I'm coming to my brother's house? My friend, shut up. I'm asking you questions. You're asking me questions. Eh? Your brother is not... By the way, how long are you staying here for? Ah, uh, it depends. My school is on strike. No. If your school is on strike, don't you have a house? Go to your mother's house now. Leave us alone. Yes, eh? brother. You must be mad for asking me such question. Do I look like your brother's keeper? Don't you have a phone to call him? Or are you not learned? I thought you are in school. Don't you know the property to do? Call people before you go to their houses. Auntie, calm down now. And listen, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Eh? We don't have enough food in this house for, 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 for extra mouth. We don't have. The food we have in this house is for me and my kids alone. Even your brother's mouth is not even included. So just come and stay just one night. Auntie, I'm not here because I'm starving. I'm here to see my only brother, my nephew and my niece now. And please now, come. Is, are they not my children? How can you just come and see my children like that without calling me? Eh? Only one night, too. Look at her, look at the way she's dressed. Look, look at you. Are these clothes? Wear glasses like, like police suma to my house. One night. You said your name is Paul, right? Yes, doctor. Okay. What can I do for you? Doctor, I need your help. 
Lately, I noticed that my vision gets blurry. And then it clears out after a while. Doctor, this is beginning to affect my daily activity. I, I don't want to lose this job. I was retrenched not long ago from a, a well-paying job. And if I lose this one, I don't know how I'm going to survive. I need my eyesight. I'm a driver. Okay. I see. But when it becomes blurry, do you feel pains? Uh, no, not really. I... It's usually just itchy. I don't feel any pains at all. And the changes you talked about, do you feel it in one eye or the both eyes? And honestly, the both eyes. But I notice it's worse when I move my left eye. But it's both eyes. Okay, you see, Mr. Paul, before we conclude anything on your matter, we are going to run a comprehensive test on you. Um, I suspect something, but then let me call one of the nurses to prepare the laboratory for the test immediately. Okay, doctor. Right. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, in my house. Yeah. Ego, in my house. Very stupid. In my house. You are dancing. You came here to dance. Ego. Aunt Priska, what is it now? Why did you off the television? You are very stupid to ask me such question. Are you mad? What kind of stupid question is that? Eh? Did you come here to watch TV? Eh? Did you? Oh, 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 oh. So my husband will deprive my children and I our entitlement just to give you money to go to school. And you use it to watch TV. This is what you do in school. What is wrong with me using my leisure time to watch TV now? Eh? Everything is what wrong. Is what is what I do in school? Everything is wrong because you are supposed to use your leisure time to read your book. Learn hand work. Many jobs. Do something. That's what your mates do. You're on strike. Yeah. Can you imagine this idiot? They're on strike. They use it to learn work. Help your brother. If you help them, will you die? People help their family. You're a woman. All you use your money to do is to buy stupid hair, rock pancake, design your face. Come, don't call me here to come and watch TV. What nonsense is this one now? Let me ask you a question. What chores have you done in my house since you came here? I've done all the chores. That's why I'm relaxing. I've done all the chores. Did you come here to relax? My friend, shut up. She's, she's saying it with pride. I've done all the chores. Eh? And you even had the ghost to even ask me what is my business. Let me tell you my business. Make money. Have you ever bought things for my children? Have you ever bought biscuits for my kids? You come here all the time to come and eat our food. Come on, biscuits. You cannot buy. If you buy biscuits, will you die? Will you die? Now, let me tell you. This is the last time. Hmm? This is the last time you watch TV in this house. You will not watch today. You will not watch tomorrow. You will never watch it in this house. Be dragging TV with my kids. And the police car. Give me that remote control. Every time you just shout like a mad woman, give, give, give that to I'm all because of my brother. Dad, what's wrong? You've been staring at the book without solving a single problem. Or don't you know it? Uh, of course I know it. What is this? What did you write here? My handwriting is clear. Dad, don't tell me you can't see what I wrote. Hello? Yes, this is Paul. From where? Oh, the hospital. I'm um, sorry, I'm in the middle of something right now. Can I call you back? Okay, all right. Thank you very much. Yes, I appreciate it. Daddy, did you just get a call from the hospital? Yes. What happened? Are you sick? No, 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 no. Listen, I'm not sick. I have a friend at the hospital. That's why they called me. But don't worry about that, okay? Let's finish with this first. So, um, this is, um, <coughs> this is soon, right? Mm -hmm. 
So the test result is out. Yes, Mr. Paul. But can I ask you a question? Yes, go ahead. Um, do you have any blind relation? Yes, my late mother was blind. That explains it. You see, Mr. Paul, the test result here shows that you have been diagnosed with um, Leon. What's Leon, doctor? It is called Leber Hereditary Optic Neuropathy. It is a form of disease that can be inherited. Okay? Yes, it is um, a form of disease that causes vision loss. The result is here. It says everything about it. Brother? Brother? Cassie. Cassie. What is it? Are you okay? You you seem lost. I'm fine. I'm fine. How are you? You should know I'm that sister that knows her brother very well. So talk to me. Um, I was actually thinking about mom. When mom was diagnosed of her sickness. Yes. What was it called? Um, I... I don't know, but... Yeah. It's, um, Leon disease. It has something to do with, um, vision loss. Brother. All of a sudden, you're talking about mom and the sickness she had. Yes. I was reminiscing, you know, and I remember as a child, when we were kids, how mom used to struggle with house chores. And knowing she was blind, I saw her as a loser. Now thinking about it, I can imagine what she went through taking care of us. You know, we had a very strong mother. Even in her condition, she never for once was cold. I know I had a blind mother, but she was the sweetest. Yes, she was the sweetest. Brother, you're hiding something from me. What is it? No, I'm not. I'm not. I just miss mom. You miss mom? Really? I do. I miss her too. I go take everything. Yeah, too fine. Classy. You like this one? This one fine. Well, it's small. It's small. You know, okay. You want something? Something big. Something. Oh, I can put my okay. glass. Uh, my coat. Okay. My. This is something ah. I like. Ah. Ah. How about this one? This is beautiful. I like. How much is this one? Mm, this one is fifty-five thousand. But this is real good quality. 50 guinea? 50 what? Oh no, Susan. 55,000. Where I want to see that money from? I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. I'm, I'm not a working class lady. Give me something cheap now. That's why I came here. Eh? Please, girl. Which of you are not a working class lady? Give me your husband. Give me money. Go market. Go buy things for her. Oh, you come small. You go take care of yourself now. Eh? Oh. Let, okay, let me be honest. Most of the things I have here, I think the lowest starts from like 25k upwards. It's too, too much. It's too, too much. Cut down. I don't tell you. I beg. No, they told. Susan, I don't beg you now. No, they call out to my, my husband. Eh? No, they call out my husband. Now, on her husband. 
Then they call husband, you go call Paul husband. That one a house, no band, band don't come out since. Please, I beg, I beg. That one a loser now. That loser, that, that man be. Eh? I beg, no, no, no call him again. People be people. Okay, so just, just look me now. He don't do. Look me. He don't do. I'll give you at one fair price. Who shall be who say price? Who shall be who say price? Do, do for me. See me now. See me. Eh? When last did they grace my sexy body with sexy things? At least I need to wear good cloth, make my figure the show. Eh? Has it gotten me jewelries before? No. Can't he give me good life? Give me luxurious things? Take me, take me to the Bahamas? I want to, I want to travel around the world. Give me treats. Yes, what I kind of husband is this? This man just deceive me with a fine face. People they call handsome, they, they call that one handsome. Handsome man, and handsome. Okay, Priska. Eh? So they call handsome man, now they call man. Okay, he don't do. Make I give you this one now. You can just take this one with you. I want this one. I want that. It's too small. Big. Make I give you this one free. You don't want. Now give me. What, what is that one? Eh? So you are coming, coming home drunk. See me here now. I was worried about you. You, you, you tell me you don't have money yet. You come home, oh, oh, drunk. You have money to drink yourself to stupor. Priska, please. Even if everybody pushes me away, not you. Eh? I'm going through a lot. I will push you away. I will reject you because <coughs> you're poverty. I reject poverty. I reject <sighs> you. Every time you tell me you don't have money, give me money, no, but the little one you have used to drink, this man, this man, who do you? Who do you this thing? My love, this is not about money. You won't understand. Hey, no, 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 come, 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 your love, come, come, your love, who is your love? Who is your love? Do you know what love is? You think love is by making mouths, right? I love you, I love you, I love you. You prove love. Okay, you love me. You love me. Where are the bags? Where are the beautiful bags? Where are the beautiful shoes? Those are the beautiful things your mates buy for their wives. <clears throat> what is this? Drunkard. You don't have money, you don't have money, but you come back drunk. Who do you this thing? Who do you this thing? Tell me, where are the gifts? My love, I am sorry. Leave me alone, who is your love? I am sorry, I could not give you all the beautiful things that you want. I'm sorry. Who is your love? <coughs> sorry for your... Mm. Mm. <coughs> eh? mm. What was I thinking? Who I offend? How did I... How, how, how did I get here? How? Eh? What was I thinking? You just deceived me with your looks. I thought you had a bright future. Now no. see now. See? No. See where the bright future got me to now? Yeah. Drunkard. Sorry for yourself. Sorry for yourself. Sorry for yourself. Go to your village and find out who did this to you. I'm very sure you are oh. cursed. You don't have money. You don't have time. Yet you are a drunkard. I'm oh. tired. Go and find out from your oh. village. I'm tired. Eh? Did they curse you? Ha! Ah, how did I get here? How did I get here? How did I get here? Hmm? I cannot continue living with that woman in my house. The sight of her gets on my nerves. You've been complaining since I came here. Okay, what are you going to do? I don't know. I honestly don't know. And I cannot chase her out. That's impossible. Who is asking you to chase her out? You be no go. No now, you're not going to do that kind of thing now. I said, what are you going to do? I'm not telling you to chase her out or not. Okay, let me break it down for you. You see this thing you're facing now? My sister, they face the same thing. My sister-in-law, that inch, left our school, came to my husband's house as madame. Neko, be doing that in my husband's house. Trust me now. I am giving it to her hot, hot. Hot, hot. She will use her head and run out of the house. That is exactly what I want you to do to your mother-in-law. Give her premium wahala. Hot, hot. Tatashi Pepe, she will use her head and run away from the house, not her leg, her head. Okay, what you're saying kind of makes sense. But Gabriel, ah, when it comes to his mother, that guy is very, very defensive. 
You go break my head. Uh, let me say now, double wala for dead body be that now. My friends, you know rich you handle. You go give your husband too. Everybody go collect. Listen, you see my husband, he cannot even try this nonsense with me. He knows me now. I Paul know what I fit to do. If Paul tries me, Paul they collect. I they give him tatache pepe. Pepe with the hot. That's what I want you to do. Mm -hmm. I like this idea. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because we cannot have two madams in one house. Bam. I need to put my mother-in-law in her place. Bam. That's what I want you to do. Now you are talking. This is not Susan when I know now. You can't let it not be you again. You will not take nonsense. I mean, a mm. marriage come you like this. I know now. Me, I married soon. I know they take nonsense. So. Mm. Give her hot hot. Please sit down. Sit Thank down. you. All right. Wow. So, what can I do for you? Um, I booked for a driver early because I have a flight to cash in three days. Okay. And I don't want to miss it. Fortunately, no one has not signed to me. Come on, what's going on? No, no. I mean, a driver was assigned to you. His name is Paul. Paul? Paul, yes. Did I hear you say Paul? Hell no. The same Paul that almost got me killed. I can never ever be in a car he's driving. No. Wait, did he offend you? Not really. Just that I love my life. You can't just hand me over to a reckless driver like him. I don't know if he's thinking or he's blind or something. Look, Mr. Titus. We got to do something about this. Like I said, the last time I entered his vehicle, he almost killed me. Yeah, so we got to do something about it. You have to replace him with another person. Or I would have to work with another transport company. Uh, no, 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 you don't have to do that. I'll, I'll talk to him. I'll replace him, okay? Okay. Um, I'll make sure we assign another, another driver to you. Better. Here in our company, our motto is your safety is our concern. All right? Thank you. So, uh, let's give me a minute. Thank you. Uh, yes, manager. Uh, make sure you assign another driver to Mrs. Dawkins. Sir, what's the meaning of this letter? Well, for your information, Paul, your services are no longer needed in this organization. Uh, uh, better put, you are sacked. Uh, sir, I can't accept this. I've been very dedicated, very faithful to this company. How do I take care of my family? How do I survive? And how do you expect me to survive when my company is, a critical, is in a critical condition just because of you? Look, the, co the customers are complaining about you. The height of it all is Mrs. Douglas. Which one of, one of our most special customers? So I have to complain about you for no, 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 no. You have to go. You, 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 you have to go. I would rather lose 20 pounds than lose one Mrs. Douglas. Oh, sir, how is it my fault? Since the incident with Mrs. Douglas, I've been very careful, extremely careful. This is not a matter of being careful, okay? Look, you have to go. You, you have to go, Paul. Not Mrs. Douglas. In fact, as we speak, leave my office. Else I get the security to, to get you out. Thank you. 
you. Hello? Madam, calm down, calm down. The owner of this phone now, they are about like this. And he don't shy you away, away, as in, you know, get himself again. Just they come now, 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 now. Okay, address, number five, Johnson Street. Yes, yes, yes. Come now, 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 now. Hmm. Please, where is this phone? It's in the phone. Okay, can I have it, please? It never pay. How much? Three thousand. Three thousand. Yes. Cassie, don't worry. I'll pay. I'll pay for the gym. I know you can't pay. Fast, fast, Madam, fast. Wait. Madam, wait. Wait, too fast, too fast. I will pay you, my friend. What is wrong with you? What are you shouting? Hello. 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 That's it. Sit Wait, down. Mother? Sit down. No, no, I can't sit down. It's already late. Madam, take, 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 take. Carry your brother, they go. Carry him. Mother, let's go. Please stand up. Please go. He's already late. Don't touch the car. Don't treat me like a small boy. Sorry, you are not a small boy, but let's go, please. Please. For your safety, for our safety. house. Eh? Hey! Eh? So, Cassie, you have turned my husband into a drunkard. Okay? Eh? You turned my husband into a drunkard, right? Uh -uh. 
understand. I don't understand. I don't give me. Will you shut up? Are you mad? Eh? Wait, so Paul, you go out, make money for yourself and your, your sister to enjoy yourself and drink yourself to stupor. Eh? Why my kids and I are starving? Why are you like this? You don't care about your husband. You don't care about what he's going through. All you care is money, money, money. You are crazy. You are very stupid. Don't, don't that fire for, for asking me such questions. You are mad. Well, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. You are not yet married. You don't know the importance of money. I don't blame you. Marriage without money is a useless marriage. That one is no marriage at all. Money is the sole purpose of living. A man without money is as good as dead. Your brother is a dead man. He doesn't have money, so he's a working corpse. You see, this, mo this, this money that, that you preach, okay. this money you are, you are so proud of, this money that you chase all about. Let me remind you, it's the root of evil. Shut up! Look at this, talking, no, 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 just making noise, making noise in my ear, talking rubbish. You asked him for money, you said money is the root of all evil. You asked him for money, you collect. Why didn't you reject it? This is the root of all evil. This is the root of all evil. You should have rejected it now. Because let me tell you, I've been eyeing you. Ever since you came into my house, my husband has been behaving in there. You're a bad influence to him. Before you come and influence my kids. See, see what you've done to your brother. You've turned him into a drunkard. You have to leave this house. News flash. You will not, you cannot chase me out of my brother's house. Please. I need to talk him into this. I will check. You, which bed? Do you think I'll, I'll keep a drunkard in my house? A drunkard will sleep in the same room with me. Both of you should go back to where you're coming from. You say I cannot drive you. Find out. I will chase you out of this house. I'll tell you this is my husband's house and not your husband's house. Stop! Stop! Stop. Yes, he is. I think yesterday was a stressful day for him at work. I want to make daddy up. Please, let daddy rest. Mom will take us to school today. Good morning, my angels. Good morning, daddy. How, how was the night? You already set for school, huh? Yes. Mina wants you to take us to school, but you don't look so well. My baby, listen, daddy is feeling weak today, but I promise you, I will take you to school tomorrow, okay? And why would daddy be weak? Why would your daddy be weak? All he does is to drink alcohol all day and come back home drunk, snoring like a pig. Listen. If you like to not man up and take responsibilities as a man in this house, sit down there, be lazing about up and down in this house. Ngoni, let's go, let's go, let's go before your daddy will make your uniforms smell of alcohol. Move it, move it. Move Have it. a nice day at school, kids. I love you. Yeah, thank you. Brother, so when do you intend to tell me? Telling you what? Your sight, of course. How did you know about it? I saw your test result in your pocket. Are you really going to end up like mom? It's going to take a while before it gets to that extent. This eye is already affected. But Cassie, my major problem is that I'm no longer needed at my workplace. Maybe this is God punishing me for treating mom badly when she was alive. I don't know. No. None of this is your fault. 
This is hereditary. Uh, have you told your wife about it? No, no, I have not. But, uh, but when do you intend? Not now, Cassie. Not now. You know how she is. I know exactly how she's going to react when I tell her. And I'm not prepared for that drama yet. I will tell her at the right time. Hey, my love, you're back. Who is your love? Don't call me your love. I don't want you. Don't call me your love. By the way, why are you here by this time? Oh, we're on strike. I took a day off. Boy, if I ask you questions, ask me straight. Uh -uh. Which one will I take? You, you took a day off. You're on strike. Why are you here? Why are you home by this time? I took a day off. For what? Why? Don't you know time is money? Oh, you don't know? Okay, let me tell you. Time is money. The time you are using to sit on this chair, you are supposed to use it to make money. Your mates are out there making money. Why are you at home? Please, can you need to understand that I need to rest? A lot happens on the road. My friend, shut up, P. Shut up. What do you do? What do you do just to drive? Drive. Drive on. Oh, Paul, I've told you you're a very lazy man. You are lazy. You're too lazy. Look at you. What do you do? Other than to drive. Drive motor. Beep, 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 beep. Even under AC. What about people? What about men that are doing hard jobs? Mechanics under the sun working on people's cars. We barrel pusher, truck pushers. People that carry cement on their heads. People are in the office with files to attend to. Are they complaining? But you are here just to drive car, drive somebody. Just to drive somebody, concentrate. Under AC, you are complaining. You are lazy, lazy man. Lazy man, they form fine boy. And some, and some with no some. You have, you have and you don't have some. See, I don't care what you say. You and I know that I'm very hardworking. Okay? My friend, shut up. Clean your mouth. Clean your mouth. Clean your mouth. Yeah, 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 yeah. Who told you I'm hardworking? You're even bragging. Are you supposed to praise yourself? Are you supposed to praise yourself? People that are working out, you sit on them. You see money, you see luxuries. Hard work speaks for itself. Listen, listen, let me tell you. One day you will come back to this house and my kids and I will have gone. Because I'm not here to suffer. They're not born me and you together. I'm not with your kidney. I will take my kids. We will live this suffer life of yours. But be, be here now. Be here. You're just and. You have hand. No sum. No sum. Go and look for some. Lazy goats. Hey. My friend, wake up! Why is he sleeping? Eh? Your mates are at work. Why are you still sleeping? Look at the time. It's 9 a.m. already. Why are you still sleeping? We are currently on a little break. Work hasn't resumed yet. You're not ashamed of yourself. My friend, shut up! Stop giving me flimsy excuses! This is the same thing you said last week and you're still saying this again. Come, come, tell me. Is there something you are not telling me? Because I am tired. You've been saying the same thing since last week, since last month. There's nothing I'm hiding. Once work resumes, I'll go to work. Hey. Hey, I know why I'm asking you. Because you have refused to give me my monthly allowance. You have refused to give me my monthly allowance and it's two weeks now, two weeks gone already. Where is my monthly allowance? Where's my money? Can you just be a little bit patient, okay? Just be a little bit patient. I'll, I'll give it to you next week. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Paul, Paul, listen, let me tell you. I will not say this. I will not take it. This is the same thing you said last week. You said it the week before last week. Now you are saying this again. I am tired. Give me my money. Give me my money. Uh -uh. Okay, this is the last time 
I will take this excuse from you. This is the last time you will tell me this rubbish. Let me wait till this weekend. Let me not see that money. Let me not see that money. This house. Hey, this house will not contain the both of us. Look at you. You're for me, fine boy. Look at you. Your mates are working. You are here for me, fine boy. Ah, my father told me, fine boys know they get money. No be so handsome. Your hands get something. Do you have something on your hand? Fine boy, fine boy, you know get money. My papa warned me before. I didn't let me tell you. If I don't see that money, if I don't see you run out of distance from me. Bet me, you know what I can do now. No sense. Never wish myself life like this. But this is what destiny gives to me. Is this my destiny? Can someone Prisca, it has been so long. How have you been? <laughs> well, I'm uh, just managing, but what can I say? Okay, um, what do I get you? No, sir, I'm fine. Thank you, sir. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Oh. So, what brings you to my office today? Sir, so it's, it's about my husband. He's not been going to work for some days now, and whenever I confront him, he will give me one excuse or the other. So I'm here. I'm here to know the truth. Wait. Are you telling me that Paul didn't tell you? Tell me what? That he has been sacked. Paul has been sacked? Why? When? How? He was becoming incom incompetent for the job. And having him around was going to cost us very much. Oh, so sorry. we had to let him go. So this is not fair now. My husband has been a very good driver to you, to your company. You can't just sack my husband because you feel or you think he's incompetent. So I'd consider now. Think about it. It's not fair. Look, Chris, guys. We have over 200 bosses, cars and jeeps in our fleet. Okay? And almost all of them are complaining about Paul. Paul, 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 you know? And they, I think he's having issues with his sight, you know? And the clients are complaining that they're not comfortable with the way he drives, you know? Thing is, uh, Paul might actually be having issues with his sight. Well, truth be told, Paul might just end up going blind. Eh? Blind? Is that bad? So wait, so all this has been happening and my husband refused to tell me about it. Okay, no problem. It's, it's okay, it's hard. Um, I'll be on my way. I need to ask my husband oh, some questions. Not so fast, not so fast. You know, a beautiful young lady like you should be living a very easy, convenient, soft life. See? Not this uh, difficult life that you live. Um, here, my card. Just call me when you need it. Mm -hmm. And uh, for your transportation. No, 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 sir. Sir, it's okay. It's, it's, fine. it's fine. It's fine. It's oh, fine. No, no, I insist. Let no, me have sir, your account. don't worry. It's, it's fine. Please come. Your account number. Okay. Um, three zero. Three zero. Five two. Five two. One seven. One seven. Eight one. Eight one. Five zero. Five zero. Okay. And the bank? First bank, sir. Uh, Priska Ugu. Yes, sir. Oh, great, great. Try. Done. Ah! Uh, uh, 50,000 naira. So this is too much now. It's just 300 naira to my house. Oh, no, no, no. Look, look, that's just a token from me. <laughs> like I said, contact me when you need any help, alright? Thank you, sir. God bless you, sir. All right, God bless you, too. Um, let me go home. All right. Thank you. Priska, beautiful Priska.
Hey! So you cannot differentiate soup from water? Eh? What is wrong with this one? I was not paying attention. It's a mistake. You're welcome. Hey, don't tell me welcome. Don't tell me welcome. You're a liar. You are a pretender, Paul. You are a liar. What did I lie about? Paul, you have been sacked. They chased you out of your working place. And you lied to me. Who told you I was sacked? Oga Titus told me everything. He, I'm just coming back from your office. He told me everything. When are you planning to tell me the truth? No, you be lying. You told me that eh, eh, you took some days off just to be in the house. I asked you the other time. I was asking you, tell me, is there something I need to know? So you lied to me. I know you, of course, what you will say, you will tell me you're waiting for the perfect time. That's what people say. When they want to lie, they tell you they are waiting for the perfect time. Perfect time, no, they come. It will never come. Where were you planning to tell me? Honey, I can explain it. No, 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 don't come here, honey. Don't, 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 don't come here, honey. So you lost your job. You were lying to me. Oh, God, 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 who died of faint? What kind of wala is this one? What kind of... Paul, why will you choose to go jobless when you're about to go blind? Why? Eh? Why did you choose this time? When your eyes were perfectly all right, why did you become jobless then? What kind of thing is this? Hey. That's true. Listen, this vision thing, it's hereditary. My mother also had it. But don't worry, God will do something. Oh, poor. God is not doing anything. Oh, God, God. I don't know. God, why me now? Why me? Who did I offend in this life? Eh? Hereditary. So you don't have sense that sicknesses that it that is inherited don't have cure. They don't have cure. I don't I don't know. Look at you. Your mates are inheriting good things, luxuries, cars, money, wealth. You went to inherit blindness. Blindness. Ah! In fact, let me just confess. I've, I've, I've hold this for too long. Let me just confess. Let me confess. I hate you. Eh, I hate you. I cursed the day I met you. I regret ever meeting a man like you. So people will be talking. You too go come out as man. If people come out as men, you will come out and stand that you are a man. You are not a man. You are not a man. You don't have money. You don't have time. Now you are most going blind. This is half dead now. A blind man is half dead. What am I using him for? Eh? You are not a man. You are you, you handsome. You have hands. You don't have some. Now blindness is, is included. What thing I will use you to do? This is the walking cops now. Eh? This is walking cops. Hey. Mom, stop it. Stop it. You are not supposed to talk to dad in that manner. Uh, uh, can you stop uh, it? Uh, teacher, come uh, so, because your daddy is here, you have wings to talk to me. You want to, uh, stop it. Please stop uh, it. Leave my son alone. If you talk to me, if you talk to me, I'm going to talk to your, your, your body. Rubbish. Move it. Move it. You can talk to me anyhow. Okay. We are thick. It's okay. okay. You can't use tears to solve this problem at hand, though. What do you expect me to do? What do you expect me to do other than to cry? Everything is not alright. You do not know how I feel. I don't know how you feel. Nobody expects such sudden bad news just dropping on their laps. I know how you feel. It's horrible. Maybe um, Paul has a reason for keeping the information away from you. No, 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 don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. How long? How long was he going to hide this from me? How long? You know, the worst part of this thing is that my husband is about to be a blind man. 
How do I go? How do I go? Oh, can't they treat it? No, he's hearing the tree. That's the only thing he heard from his mother. What do I do with the kids? How do I come out? Why stay with the kids? It's okay. It's okay. You'll be fine. You have to be strong. Eh? You have to be strong. <laughs> Listen, okay. Let's just, just try and forget all this bad news. I know it's off the way you and I can go. And then we can call off. Let's just go and call off, okay? Just for, for a minute, just forget about all these things. We need it. Even I need it. Oh, Chris. Thank you. So he will not see again. My love, it's you. You know, it's my ghost. What, what do you mean it's me? Are you blind? Where are you coming from? I've been calling you. You didn't take my calls. Why? Why, why, why should I take your calls? Why? No, tell me why. Why should I take your calls? What are you, what are you calling me for? Why, why are you calling me? What are you calling me for? Am I the cause of your, your joblessness or am I the cause of your sight problem? I see you've had too much to drink. Let me take you inside. <gasps> Let's go. Let me take you inside. <laughs> don't, don't, don't touch me. Take me inside for what I have legs. You want to take me inside? You that, that is having sight problem. You want to take me inside? I am the one. I am the one to take you inside. I am the one to take you inside, not, not you. How would you even know, know how to take me inside where you couldn't even see when I came in? You didn't even, you didn't even see it. Babe, I understand you're upset with me. I understand it perfectly. I should have told you about my job loss. I should have told you about my sight. But please understand. I was trying to protect your feelings. Who asked you? Who asked you? Who asked you to protect my feelings? Did I ask you to protect my feelings? Did I ask you to protect my feelings? Don't protect my feelings. I didn't ask you to do that. See, if, if you had told me, if you had told me, if you had told me, if you had told me about this cause in your family, Makachuku, I wouldn't have gotten married to you. I wouldn't have gotten married to you. I see clearly you're not in the mood to talk. Good night. Good night. Good night to yourself. Good night. Night to you. You can't even protect yourself. You want to look at this thing. Stupid man. Oh my god, this is not happening. This is not happening. What is it? What? 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 Please. Why are you shouting? I need help. I, I can't see anything. You cannot see? I can't see. My eyes! Priska, help me! Stop it! Uh, what do you want me to do now? Should I pluck out my eyes to give to you? Priska. You need to go blind now or later now. So deal with it. Don't, don't disturb my sleep, I beg. Priska, how can you talk to me like that? Priska, I can't see now. Priska, help me. Priska, I can't see. Help me. What are you doing? What is this? Let's see. What are you doing in my room? What gave me right to buy into my room like this? What? You came, so you came into my room! I we can to help me. Can you me. Help, this, my Kassi, help me! Please, your brother cannot see Kassi! Is it, is it, you are screaming all, all of this! What is happening? I, 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 I can't see! I can't see! What is going on? Uh, oh, oh, I can see someone is tired of watching movie. You're tired of watching TV. And she's not taking the responsibility of the new wife in the house. Go on, continue. Nice one. Please, please excuse me. Uh, my new yaw. Continue. It's obvious that you don't care. It's obvious that you that is meant to do this, you don't, you feel less concerned. So please, allow me to do my newfound duties diligently. I don't want distractions, please. I, am I stopping you? I'm only commending you now. Carry on. Go on. Continue. Eh? And that's what's my thing, yeah? Cassie. So you knew, Cassie. You knew, you knew that Paul was blind. You knew, Cassie, and you hid it from me. 
Cassie, you eat it for me, Cassie. You're a wicked girl. Do you care? Do you care? Do you behave like a wife? Do you behave like a woman under a man? So what's the essence of telling me? Don't tell me now. You've already kept it to yourself. Don't tell me. What is my business? You are the new Yahweh in the house. You are the new wife. So continue. Do the duty. I don't really care. Like you said, I don't care. But let me remind you. Know the body that comes with taking care of a liability like your brother Paul. Hope you know. I take exception to that. My brother is not a liability. Ah, it's a liability. If you like, you shut and shine your eye. It will not change the fact that it's a liability. He's blind. He's in your family now. He Family of blindness. I'm very sure very soon your own sight will run off, would fly. Before you finish this cloth, be fast though, so that this, this sight will not run off before you finish the cloth too. What kind of if I knew I wouldn't have even entered this kind of blind family. Family of blindness. Oh, blind family. Watch that cloth very well before you go blind though. Jesse Bell. I don't blame you. I blame my brothers for marrying you. Obim de re du atolo jo Obim de re du Chuku mare homo gemere mo Obim de re du Obim de re du atolo jo Obim de re du Chuku mare homo gemere mo do Chukumari Homoga Marimo. Again, the red. Dad! Hmm? Dad, are you crying? Oh, of course not. I'm not crying. I'm not crying. I'm fine, okay? We heard you this morning. Oh, Jachi, I, I, I fell. I slipped and fell in the room. I'm fine now. You don't have to hide it. I understand. We know how you feel. Everyone mocked you in this condition. But we are proud of you for being our father. Dad, I don't care of your condition. You will be well soon. I bless God. I bless God for giving me Intelligent and wonderful kids like the two of you. I think with you both by my side, I will surely get over this. Who will be your eyes, hand, and feet so that you won't worry about anything again? I love you. You two are my angels. Eh? Come yeah, if you two, Dad. Jachi, come. I love you. Eh? So as it is now, I'm like the breadwinner in the house. My husband's blindness is not a liability to me. I literally do the, the husband's role in my house. So please, I beg you. I would appreciate if you can help me. If you can. Is there any problem? No, oh, no, no, no problem at all. You know what? Why don't we go somewhere cool where we can you know, really talk? Hmm? Okay, it's, it's fine, we can. Provided you be able to. Well, of course. I'm, I'll be willing to. I am able to do. As long as you are ready to do what I want to do. <laughs> what do you mean? What? I don't understand. Okay, um, when we get to somewhere very convenient, I'll explain to you. Alright? Okay, let's go there. So
brother. Cassie, is that you? Yes. It's past midnight. Please go in and sleep. I'm waiting for Priska. Is she back yet? She's not. And I don't think she's coming back tonight. That's unusual. Where could she be? But I don't know. And wherever Priska is, I bet you she's comfortable. Are you sure? Are you sure she's not in any kind of danger? Brother, I don't know. And believe me, she's not coming back this night. Okay. There's no problem. She will come and explain to me where she went to. Let's go. Easy, easy. What did we just do? Why didn't you stop me? Come on, darling. I couldn't resist a beautiful woman like you. Besides, you were the one telling me of how you no longer enjoy having sex with Paul. That does not mean I would cheat on him now, eh? That does not mean I would cheat on my husband. We had a lot to drink and I, I guess we got caught up at the moment. Hmm? But this is not nice. How do how do I stand my husband, knowing I just cheated on him with his boss? Ex, you mean ex-boss? Look, Priska, I can take care of you, okay? I'm, I'm coming. Give me your account number now. Please, please, you have it now. You have it. You've been sending me money now. Yes, I, I do, I do, I do. Okay. Uh, yes. Oh, that's it. Go. Two fifty thousand. Yes. Just for this thing we just did. Thank you. It's okay. I know this. There's a lot more where that came from. As long as you are always ready to give it to me the way I like. Thanks. I think there's a better way to say that. Come on. Okay, please stop. Stop. Come on. Okay. Babe, good morning. I, I've been waiting for you all night until this morning. I thought something bad had happened to you. I went to work. But you, you didn't tell me you had started working. Mm. I've started, though. I've started. You know, I went there. I went for, in, for the interview. Immediately, they collected me and decided I should start working immediately. So. Wow. <laughs> Congratulations. I'm happy for you. So, what kind of work is it? Yeah. Work is work. Now, which one is what kind of work is it? You don't have work. I'm working for you. Ask me what kind of work is this. You should be happy I'm helping you with this, your blind condition. Uh, uh, don't ask me too many questions. I beg, I beg, I beg. You see, I'm, I'm not crying uh, with you this morning. No. Don't I, make it out. No. I'm, I'm sorry, my love. I, I'm just concerned. You even sound tired. I'm Shh. tired. Ah. Let me call Cassie to boil water for you to beat. Cassie! Hey, no, it's okay, it's okay. I can help myself. Which Cassie? I can help myself. I'm tired. Don't worry. What nonsense is that? Imagine, I would have given her a dirty slap. What kind of nonsense is that? She doesn't know me. You see how she's stopping me? What nonsense is that? Who, who was stopping you? What's wrong with that, your stupid secretary? Imagine stopping me to come to your office. 
she was stopping you? Yes! Did you tell her I was coming? No, I did, I did. In, in fact, look, don't worry. She's very lucky. I'm not, a, I'm not, I'm not normal. I'm not normal. I think she should calm down. She's I, very lucky I'm in a good mood. I would have given her a dirty slap. Don't worry, my love. I will talk to her and I'll make sure this never happens again, okay? Very it's okay. So very sorry. Tough. You, I was, I couldn't wait to see you, dear. Hmm? So, not that girl. She just wants to spoil my mood. Eh? Don't mind her. Don't mind her. Hmm? But it's fine. It's fine. Okay. So tell me, what did you keep for me? Where well, I kept everything beautiful that I know that you will enjoy, you know, in cash and in kind. Wow. Yes. In cash and in kind. Kind. When infidelity is a sacrilege. Where are my babies? Where are my babies? Mama is young. Hey. Hey, beautifuls. I got you guys something. Da -da 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 -da. Look at them now. Take them and look at them. Mm -hmm. They are beautiful, right? Yes. You like? All this was. Mommy, this must be very expensive. Yes, they're pretty expensive, but nothing is too expensive for my babies. Where do you get the money from? Oh, Chachi, you're a mood spoiler. You just want to spoil these things. I walk. What kind of work is that? I work really hard. Really, really hard. You ask too many questions. Go on, go on, one of it. You don't, don't you want it? What kind of work is oh, that? Oh, does it matter? I got you beautiful things. Go on, have it. Go, go, just have it. Have it, have it. We have, we have fun, have fun. Take whatever you like. It's just for the both of you. Mm hmm What kind of work? Oh, just if you don't want to eat, then leave it. Drop it, drop, drop, drop it. Just go, 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 go. Drop it and leave, leave. What is this? Do you want to do the work for me? What kind of work? What kind of work? What kind of work? And you, Mona. Are you going with him? Hi, hi. When women respect themselves, let's go back to the olden days. To the olden days. The children and they go to sleep. Yeah, yeah, go witches. Go, go witches. Where are you going to? I'm going to bed. Which bed? You're not going inside, though. See? I... Yes! From now on, you are not going to sleep. You can sleep anywhere. You can sleep in the parlor. You can sleep in the toilet, in the kitchen. That's your business. But if you see my room and my children's room, it's no good area. Why are you chasing me out of the bedroom? Because I cannot sleep with a blind man. Is it not obvious? That's a rhetorical question now. I cannot sleep with a blind man. I don't want my children to sleep with a blind man. Excuse me. You're talking to your husband like that. Well, I'm talking to your own husband. Excuse me. I thought you wanted to say something. You're talking to your own husband like that. This is your husband. Take him with you. Sleep anywhere you want to sleep with him. But you see my room? Don't come there. If you come there, I will pour water on your body. Brother, this woman has really beaten more than she can chew. I don't like this. It's okay. You can sleep. I'll be fine. I'm not sleeping. I will. I'll. I'll. I'll sleep here with you. You can sleep. Go and sleep. I'll be fine. Okay. I'll be fine. You just sleep first. It's like I moved from grace to grass. Since Gabriel lost his job, I've been footing the bills single-handedly. I feel your pain, my friend. I was in your position. That's how I was carrying the burden in my husband's house. I was doing virtually everything in the house. I don't see God, God. See this God. God loves me so much. 
Auntie God sent a good Samaritan, a, a generous, kind man that is generous to me. He's the one taking care of all my bills. I don't stress myself anymore. Yes, you. That's why you're shining with me now. You can say that again, my friend. It's like you introduced me to this, your good Samaritan. Okay? Because right now I need help in my life. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This, my good Samaritan, is for me and me alone. But, you know, I, you're, you're my friend, and please, you were there for me when things were rough. I remember the other time you dashed me back, so. I can be very considerate. I. What should I do? Okay. I will have to call him to see if he has a generous friend like him to link you up with. So, I'll do that for you, please, for that back seat. You're there for me. Huh? Are you cheating on Paul? No. Desperate situation calls for desperate major. A woman has to do what a woman has to do. Mm -hmm. I do not support you cheating on your husband. Mahano did that. I beg you, make a year word. I beg. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. I don't come here for you to advise me. What is it? You are the one that said you want help. I said, make a link you up. You want to advise me. Listen, you see this thing where I enter now? I know they come out. I want to make enough money. Establish myself enough that I will not go back to that situation again. God forbid. They know they leave that go back. Now, front, front, I they go. As I don't start, I'm at the finish. Uh -uh. Make I, you two do. Make I link you up. Thank you very much. I cannot cheat on my husband. Who they say me you they cheat? I beg you, can link you up. Please. Now you talk say you want help. Make my call up. Thank you. Sakma go kill you for you. They do thank you. They do good girl. Make I see. Sir, good morning, sir. <laughs> My night was fine, but it would have been better with you. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> you know, staying with you is always tough notch. <laughs> You're very funny, sir. Okay, sir. Mm. You, sir, you, you know now you're the kind of man every woman desires to be with. Yes, sir. All right. No problem, sir. Yes, sir. Eh. Okay. I'll, I'll find time to come and stay with you, be with you. Sure of what you're saying. I am 100% sure. She was on the call all morning. Whoever that person is, that man is the one who's been giving her the money she has been spending. Mm -hmm. I thought as much. I thought of it too. Just that I didn't have proof. I'm going to confront her. She will have to choose between me and that man. Mm. Brother, I bet she will not choose you. I mean, this is the same woman that banished you from your matrimonial bed. Or did she change? Cassie, I am going to confront her. I can take anything from Prisca, but not her cheating on me. Mm -hmm. where, where are the kids? They are outside playing with their mates. Good. Because I don't want them to hear our conversation. Oh. I don't want them to think that their mother is a bad woman. Oh. 
Brother. You know you're a very good man. You're still protecting that woman after all she's done to you. Cassie, I don't have another choice. She's still my wife. She's still my wife. Wife. Indeed. Yes, I did. Please sit down. I want to talk to you. What is it? Listen, I hope you don't want to ask me for money because I don't have a dime to give to anybody. Priska, I want to talk to you about something. And I need you to be very honest with me. Who is the man you were speaking with on the phone earlier? Wait, oh. Paul. So you've been eavesdropping on my conversation? Hey, Paul! That's not an answer to my question. Who is he? How is it your business? It is my business, Priska. You're my wife. Look at this one. It is my business. You're, you're, you're shouting and shining your eyes so that I'll be fast. I of cannot you. have you cheat on me under my roof. How is it your business? You are it is my business. You are blind. You still have strength to shout. It is my business. You want me to run from this place for you? Eh? Eh, eh I'm cheating on you. Eh, you've, you've said it yourself. I'm cheating on you. Yes, I'm cheating with someone. A better man that you can never have not be in your entire life. I always knew you were a very desperate person. Very desperate and ambitious. But being a cheap slut is the height of it. Priska, I'm ashamed of you. You should be ashamed of yourself. It is your mother that is a slut. You should be ashamed of yourself that your ex boss is taking care of me. Yes, he's taking care of me financially and sexually. Sexually. Priska, are you cheating on me with other titles? You are blind. Are you also dead? I am shitting on you. You heard me. I said your boss is taking care of me financially and such. Come on, come on, come on. Priska. So we may not be generation. Priska. Like a oh yeah, you don't care, you don't care about the implications of our mothers. When infidelity is a sacrilege, oh, to the early days of our mothers. When women respect Mother? themselves, let's go back to the other days. When respect is the order of the day to the early days of our mothers. Huh? Hey! God!
Nifugonian. Just like that. Have you seen it? That's why I see him. No, this man is not supposed to die. At Who? his early age. At his prime. He has his wife and his children that he's supposed to take good care of. Yeah? He's my very good friend. My very good friend. He's not supposed to die. He's really Is it true? It's true. Jesus. I talk him. Just like that. Just like that. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. That's the piece. That's the piece. Wow. Because I lost his heart. Lost my team. See, can you imagine? It's very working. Yes. Sorry, I can stand this. Mama. It's going to be more than a is I'm pulling you now, so you can handle it. Until we see again, my brother. Hey! Praise God. After everything, see how you ended up. I have been this wicked to my husband. What did I gain after all? Nothing. Mr. Titles, cause be the day I met you. You, you lured me into all this. Look at me now. I am down with strange illness. If incarnation is anything to go by, I would marry Paul again so I can make amends for all the evil I did to him. God. Some women of this generation, they live their lives the way they like them all. Oh, yeah, yeah. They don't care. They don't care. About the implications, yeah. they don't bother about their children's destiny, oh, yeah. and they don't bother if their husbands are hot or not. Ooh. Let's go back to the old days, to the old days when respect is the order of the day. Let's go back to the early days.